some viewers may find the following video disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. Well, hello and welcome back to the channel. In today's video, we follow Harvey Jailbird as he walks up on a crime scene investigation and believes that he is going to be a hero to the community as he claims to be investigating cops who he suspects might be doing something wrong. Oh yes, and he even wants to search the car. And pat down the officers as well. The guy has no brains whatsoever. So let's sit back, relax, and enjoy the show. What's going on, ladies and gentlemen? This video was recorded on November the 3rd, 2022, in Oak Cliff, Dallas, Texas. I'm riding around, patrolling, just trying to keep the streets safe. My, 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 Jailbird, you fancy yourself a hero? But all you are is a legend in your own mind, full of crap as well. I'm just doing my job. When I notice this suspicious activity taking place at this apartment complex, so I go over to investigate, and it's pretty apparent pretty quick that this woman was probably a victim of domestic violence, and she called the police there to file a report. So I did not interfere with that at all, but I had some concerns after watching these officers for a little bit, and when they weren't helping this woman, I had to conduct my own investigation on these officers. Hope you guys enjoy the video. I'll see you later. See what they got going on. If they're running this tag. Trying to write this guy a ticket. They're gonna let him go now that they see us. Writing him a ticket. Writing this girl a ticket. Come on, Jailbird. Why would they be writing her a ticket if she's the victim of the abuse? Jeez, you're not the smartest man out there, are you? Pulling her out of the car. Liar! And a bold-faced liar, too. This cop did not put his hands on her. She got out of the car on her own accord. If you're going to tell a lie, don't show a video that contradicts the lie. I'm the one that blurred her face out because he sure as hell didn't do it. He exposed her face to the internet. Looks like maybe she was a victim of a crime. Sure looks like he's writing her a ticket though. Are you such a cop here that you don't believe that they were trying to help her out? I mean, you said they were writing her a ticket, but now the picture's becoming more clear that she's been involved in an issue, and they're trying to investigate and help her out.
Hey, it looked like you stumbled a minute ago. Are you all right? You okay? Looked like you almost stumbled there a minute ago. You haven't been drinking anything tonight, have you? Are you sure? Any prescription medications? Anything we need to know about? This is what Jailbird was talking about. It was a minor stumble in a step when he was talking to Jailbird's friend over there. And that's the only observation he's able to make to try to make a connection to illicit substances. So he's trying to make a mountain out of a grain of sand. And that's still no justification for what he's about to do. Look like you lost your balance here for a minute. Care if we take a look around in your car? Corporal, two strikes. Computer screen open. What you say? Came from. Yep, close it down. Hey, you mind if I look around in your car? Doesn't want me looking around. Consent denied. Well, yeah, of course, with all sorts of stuff in there that you can use against him, why should he let you search his car? He would be an idiot to let you do it. Yeah. Oh, she's from Mississippi. Look at that. Covington, I know where that is. No. This is quickly becoming one of those kind of deals that I don't even like to this is turning just turn into a medical situation you know what I mean well if you didn't like the situation to begin with why did you not walk away and why did you even bother posting it online if you didn't like it anyway I guess you were just desperate for content that night I guess that's what it was all about yeah because you're taking pictures of her face that cop is still Taking the report or writing her? He's taking a report. I guess he's taking a report. They're going to check her vitals and stuff. If that pig could get out of the way. It seems suspicious to me that he wouldn't let me uh, take a look around. You know what I mean? Yeah. And then that seems suspicious. No, that's not suspicious at all. That's more than likely following security protocols not to let idiots like you rummage through their car. Kind of suspicious you let me search your vehicle. Yeah. We'll see if we can get, get his partner to consent to a pat down. Yeah, it's pretty suspicious to me. I'm over this, man. Let's get it. I'm over this one. This lady gets it. Let's call it. Yeah, let's, let's go. Let's go to the next one. Yeah, come on. Let's go. We're out of here. Right there near the end, there were a number of jump cuts right after he said he was going to go ask one of the officers if he could pat him down. So which leads me to suspect there was something said by one of them that didn't fit his narrative, so he had to cut it out. I mean, Harvey Jailbird, what did that officer say to you that made you want to delete it forever?